Hello, welcome on in, Cancer, to your next 30-day reading. This is a general reading, and I'm going to pull two overall oracle messages for you, Cancer. I hope you've been well. Cancer, do me a favor. Take a deep breath. Release it. Relax. Get comfortable. And... Let's dive in. Okay, what do the archangels have to say? Nurture. I love that. I'll look at that in a moment. Let's pull you a mystical wisdom oracle for the overall, and then we'll be I'll be doing a Celtic cross with the tarot. Okay, what do we have for cancer? If you are American, I hope you had a wonderful holiday for Thanksgiving. And now we're going into Christmas time. But if you're watching this at another time, I. Okay. Let's see. Confrontation. I don't know if I've ever gotten that card before. Pick your battles wisely. Self-resilience. Don't be afraid to fly solo. Okay, so now is the time for you to be nurturing and taking care of your needs. Especially if you have been through some difficult times. Difficult people could be... Um, just a very burdensome, a lot of work, health stuff. Okay. I do feel like it's saying that you really need to take care of your needs, fill your own cup at this time. Also, her crown with the makes me feel like this is a time you really need to seek um, your higher self. Wisdom here and intuitive downloads. Follow your intuition. Okay. Nurture. Archangel Gabriel. You are, as a nurturer, a child. You nurture your own inner child. Both activities are important for you right now. That's right. Okay. We're going to go ahead and go into the tarot. And I'm going to look at the heart of the situation. Show me this for cancer, please. This is the heart of the situation, the center of it. I'll be briefly commenting on the cards as they come out with my first impressions, and then we'll dive in and we'll clarify. Okay, the strength, and this is crossing it, the Seven of Wands. Yeah, you're, you're defending yourself. Staying strong. Okay, let's keep going. Look at the foundation. The Four of Coins. Hmm. Trying to stabilize. Also being resourceful. Okay. Show me more. Let's look at the past energies. Thank you. Ace of Cups. Yeah, having to fill your own cup. Self-care. All right, let's look at your crowning thoughts here. Oh, the Ten of Cups. You're hoping, you're wishing for the best outcome in this. I love that energy. All right, we're going to be taking a look at what is coming towards you. In the near future. What is coming towards Cancer? Or Cancerians? 
victory, the six of wands. You are rising above this. Yes, you're coming out of this period of burdens, conflict. All right, let's get your um, fears here. Let's look a little bit into the fears. Okay. The full, this is the King of Pentacles with the Nine of Wands. The King of Pentacles is a very stubborn, grounded energy. Okay. And the Nine of Wands is also about having been through battles, learned lessons, and becoming wiser from this and guarding yourself. Okay, we're going to move more into that in a moment. I want to look at what are the external energies. Uh, okay, the five of coins. I feel like someone or a group of people are taking you under their wing. Showing you some love, giving you a helping hand. All right, let's look at your authentic wishes and hopes here. Authentic wishes and hopes. Thank you. Oh, I love that card. It reminds me so much of the Freya that artist, the poet, um, wow, strength, just owning your authenticity with the Queen of Swords here. Unashamed, I am who I am. If you don't like it, you know, keep, keep on moving. Yeah, I love that energy for you, Cancer. Okay, let's get the outcome for Cancerians, please. This one, and I feel like this one, okay. Ah, overcoming this conflict, you're rising above this with the seven of wands coming out confident, standing up for what you believe in, yeah. Okay, with the five of wands is conflict, um, competition confrontation all right interesting so let's go ahead and start to clarify for you i'm going to start with the strength card here at the center so it does look like you have been nurturing yourself becoming stronger healthier quieting some of those negative thoughts yeah Nine of Wands coming through the conflict. You've come through the battle. You've learned these lessons. You've grown from this. Okay, I see a lot of growth here. Okay, so here with the Seven of Pentacles. This is investing in yourself, investing in growth. This is also about routines. So some of you could really be taking care of yourself, following routines, eating right, sleeping. Okay. Show me the seven of coins here. Yeah, the page of pentacles. Really going towards your goal, keeping your focus. I love this energy. Wow, Cancer. Congratulations. Okay, the four of coins here. Show me this at the foundation. This is stability, being resourceful, being grateful for what you have. You have enough. Of course, it's always good to strive for more, but I feel like you have enough. You've walked away from something here. 
Yeah, you've had enough. That keeps just coming to mind. So I feel like in the past you could have had enough. You could have said enough is enough and you walked away. You took care of yourself. I feel like you did not engage with this confrontation. I feel like you have moved away from that. Okay, the Ace of Cups here, filling your own cup with the strength. I love that. See how that, yeah, becoming stronger, brave, a lot of bravery. I'm hearing you've been really brave through all of this. Okay, the Ten of Cups. This is wishing, hoping for the bright future. Okay, show me that. Thank you. <laughs> Celebration, four of wands. Celebrate. A little bit of, I'm seeing that um, you've gotten out to nature a little bit. Okay, because they're out in the country. This is a peaceful country life. Enjoying the beauty. Enjoying new stability. Celebrating. Okay. Six of Wands. This is overcoming with victory. Could be rallying others as well. Could be encouraging others or someone has encouraged you. Okay, let's keep going. Show me the Six of Wands for Cancer. Thank you. And the Wheel. Okay. The Two of Cups and the Ace of Swords wanted to come out with that. Okay. So it does look like things have turned into your favor. You've seen something clearly. Okay. And also, too, I feel like this has to do with a partnership. If not a partnership, um, a friendship, this is just both two sides of yourself coming together. Okay, I hope that makes sense. We're going to move forward. And we're going to look at these spheres here with the, the king of coins with the nine of wands. What is this? A, a fear of... I do think that um, there's been some fear over finances. Okay. King of Wands. Also a fear of, do I have what it takes? Will this last the long term, I'm hearing. Okay. All right, let's keep going. Five of Queens in the external environment. Again, I feel like you've found either a community of friends or um, some kind of guidance or helping hand. is could be rallying you on or you are helping someone. Let's look at this more because this is external from you. You just may be blending well with your companions, your friends, your tribe. I'm hearing, okay. Ah, the Empress. Yeah, you're nurturing your, your connections. Uh, or th these connections are nurturing you and vice versa. Oh, yeah, I love that. Okay, let's look at, I almost said, let's look at Freya. It is our Queen of Swords here. All right, the Chariot, the Eight of Swords with the Hanged Man. I feel like here, after a period of feeling stuck and unable to take action, that you are ready and willing to go forward and take this action, okay? Only you can know what action that is. I just feel like you're going forward in bravery. You're breaking yourself free, Cancer. Okay, from this mental 
These are mental swords. These are illusions. And I feel like you are moving out of that. Let's look at the outcome with the Five of Wands here and the Seven of Wands. Yeah, I feel like you're not even engaging with whatever confrontation or conflict is around you. You're rising above. You've grown too tall for this. You've grown too tall, Cancer. Okay. Yep. Yeah. The Fool. Yeah. New beginning. New start. Carefree. I don't care what you do. It's not my business. I'm on my own journey. And I also feel that you are trusting the universe to provide these next steps for you. So you're going forward, brave, strong, and hopeful. Wow, what a powerful reading. I'm going to go ahead and pull some advice for you. Let's get Cancer's advice. Okay, Ooh, you got two of them. Cleanse. Your body, mind, and soul are urging you to take time out for some much-needed cleansing. Just as you wash your car, clean the house, or tidy your office, your body also needs care and attention. It's time for some spiritual, emotional, and physical cleansing. I love that. That's beautiful. Self-care. See, I can't, like... The spirit is so good. I, I just mean, like, these messages have been so on target. Okay. Excuse me. My nose is running. Do I wipe my nose in a minute? Okay. Channeling. <laughs> okay. How is the time? Oh, now is the time to love, nurture, and heal yourself. Self-love is... Not simply a state of mind for feeling good. It's a state of appreciation for yourself that grows and matures from actions that you take to support your body, mind, and soul. Again, this may be where I, I felt the coming together. I feel like all these um, parts of you are finally coming into harmony and you're getting a much needed healing. I'm going to be pulling one more closing advice for you, Cancer. And these are messages from the light that you can meditate on or focus on or just take the message. All right, what do we have? Soul team to close out. Okay. Oh, and you got two more. Things are coming in twos for you. All right, gathering. Ooh, again, a community, like-mindedness, networking for some of you, and insight. These are these are um, messages or downloads that are coming from spirit at this time. Okay, so I feel like. Spirit is guiding you on what steps to take to help you nurture yourself. Like, are you eating enough? Are you drinking enough? Go to bed. That kind of nudges that you get. I feel like um, you're listening to that. Oh, that's a beautiful reading. Okay, Cancer, I hope this reading was helpful. Let me know down in the comments below how this pertains to you. I want to see you back here next month for your 2024 reading. Okay, bye-bye.